EXE fuel economy, we publish 25% yeah. improved fuel consumption or fuel economy at a tons per liter basis over a conventional power shift machine. When you get into aggressive truck loading applications, what, what the CVT does is it kind of acts like a direct, or it is pretty much a direct drive system. Like on our standard machines now, we have lockup clutch, which is a direct drive. It takes out the torque converter. And the torque converter itself is so at best maybe 90% efficient. So what we've done is take that direct drive kind of methodology, as Bill went through in that, that cool technical video that he showed, is you have the direct drive not only in roading applications, but is in that um, is in the load and carry. So when you're digging, what's inefficient about a torque converter machine is the oil is sloshing around in the torque converter. You have an amplified torque ratio, which which helps helps the machine dig into the pile. But it's inefficient because once you stall, you're stalled in the pile. The machine's not moving forward, but the transmission is turning. The transmission is turning, and that's causing some inefficiency. So in the second XE machine, it's not. So you're, you're very efficient. So again, in that application, you could see upwards of 40% or 45% efficiency improvement over a standard torque converter. If you watch a 972 MXC load, you notice the performance series bucket very fast, very clean, very efficient, very full bucket loads as it goes into this material. Another thing to note, as Bill commented, is the, the fuel efficiency or the energy recovery. As it makes that directional move, going from reverse into forward, you're lifting the bucket. On other competitive loaders and previous generation machines, you're using engine power and engine fuel to fuel that, that application. For the XC, it takes that momentum out of the drivetrain and retarding, as we've heard about in the classroom, it turns that into the energy used by the pumps. So they're covering the free energy and reusing it. The first one is the 972K. With the single clutch speed shifts, it, it does ramp up really quickly. The thing to note here is the downshift at first. You can see that downshift right there. As it slows down, it ramps up through the pile and stockpile application. So up next, you're going to see the 972 MXE do the same exact thing. But what you'll notice is, is because it's a continuously variable transmission, there is no need to downshift. So again, what that means to the customer is more efficient, faster stockpiling in their application. So again, note the same thing. Similar ground speed, very quick response. You see the power right through. The new performance series buckets that came out on, on the end of H series and the K, same thing. Bill mentioned the other features we have on the XC is the, the grade holding capability. You can see there is no rollback on that machine until he backs out of the pile. So that's not only good with high speed stockpiling, but it's very good in other applications. As we know, medium wheel loaders are, various, are, are used in various applications. So the anti rollback is not only good in the stockpiling, but for hopper charging, we have to hold the grade.